Hi, I'm Anna. I believe that uh, every business starts from the heart of something. I have five children and eight grandchildren. I have children who had severe learning disabilities, and I've had children who are extremely bright, no learning disabilities, just social disabilities. My youngest son, um, he had sensory processing disorder, and when he was 18 months old, they told us he had Asperger's. So I was a parent who embraced that title, and I started living my life to that. And I took care of my son in that way. And he's the youngest of five, and he wanted to go to school so desperately. And after two weeks of kindergarten, it was a nightmare. He was screaming because he did not want to get out of bed. So I sold my first business. I discontinued working with eWomen Network and dedicated my life to my family. And I stayed home and I homeschooled my children. So from the time he was in kindergarten until he was nine years old, I was homeschooling and I couldn't teach him to read. My husband is so wonderful. He sent me to California to learn a reading program. He sent me to Iowa. He said, I'm, in, I'm certified in quite a few reading programs and I still could not teach my son. And a friend said, hey, you need to check out this thing, Brain Balance. And I'm like, it's on BK's right. No way, the money's not there. I can't afford that. So I stayed away. And a year later, I still could not teach my son and he just didn't seem to be maturing like the other boys around him. So my husband and I prayed and we went to B Caves Road. We had enough money to do an assessment. And we thought, well, let's have our daughter assessed too. So we had the assessment done and they told us that our son was going to have to go through their $6,800 program three times. And we thought, there's no way we can afford that. And long story short, um, the money was provided. And I tell people, if this is what you're supposed to do, everything will fall into place. The schedule, the time, the money. And I'm telling you, on a Thursday afternoon, my husband said, you just pray about it and we'll see what happens. On Monday, we had the money and came from uh, a uh, insurance policy we didn't know existed. And so we put our child through the program. I sat in that lobby for six months watching children and families go in and out. There were some women who came in there that after six months, I, I, I saw one lady and I was like, man, I don't think she's the same one. She must have had some major work done. <laughs> and, and I did, I mean, she was looking good. And I asked her, I said, so what are you doing? You know, she'd only been in the program for eight weeks. And I'm like, so what are you doing? You know, and she said, I was able to take a shower without worrying about my son running out the door. I was able to go to a friend's house. We were able to go on a vacation. Some of these children are so hyper. Some of these children are so emotional. The parents are running around, moms, they're running to tutoring, they're running to nutritionists, they're running to vision therapy. They're doing all of these things. And the more I saw them come and just everything was being solved it, right there in front of my eyes, there's progress reports. You go to a progress report and I went to my third progress report and unfortunately at that time I knew more than the director in the program and um, I was like, wait a minute. And all I had done was read the book. So uh, long story <coughs> short, within three, three or four weeks my husband and I owned the Brain Balance mm -hmm. in Austin and we have continued to serve families in our communities and make a difference. My son is one of the top ballet dancers in Austin at Ballet Austin, also at ASPVA. He no longer has sensory issues. He has tons of friends. He is doing well in school. He is in a school now and our lives have turned around and as an owner, I've, I've been there, I've done that and when a parent is struggling, I know right where they are and so uh, we are getting ready to open our second location, and um, if you know a family who is struggling, you know, whose child is not being invited to that birthday party, who is struggling in school, give us a call. Let them know where we are. Thank you.